Welcome to another tutorial on the SMOKE program and its functions. For this video, we're going to explain how to view your training record, how to access and print your training certificates. We're going to start from the login screen for SMOKE, so enter your login credentials, either your email or your PIN, enter your password, and log into the system. This should be the first screen you see. If you see an update user screen, go ahead and make sure that your information on your um, profile page is up to date and select the update user. You'll get a green confirmation bar and then you'll be redirected to this screen. From this screen, you're gonna have many options on the side. Please bear in mind that um, the regional administrators, the regional coordinators, we have extra options so that we can help assist the rest of the state in doing some of the functions for the SMOKE program. As a regular user, you're gonna select My Data. If you wanna view your information, you're then gonna select the My Profile button. As you can see, it's gonna bring up your demographic page. This should be your primary information, your address, phone number, date of birth, driver's license, and email. If you're looking for your training record, what you wanna do is you wanna, underneath the red line, slide two tabs over, select a tab that says Training Activity. This will then give you a list in, new, in order of date for the training that you have accomplished while a firefighter in the state of Michigan. For any individual program that you wanna view, select the Options button next to the course, and you're gonna either have Details or Print Certificate. If you do not have the ability to print the certificate, that means that either the course itself was not passed or in the case of some courses, the documentation is not complete. But if you do have the print certificate button, you may go ahead and select that. That's gonna take you to a new window and the system will generate a printable certificate for you based on the course that you selected. If you note on the certificate, you have a class number in the lower right the last six digits is your personal identifier number, PIN number in SMOKE. You'll also note that it's dated by who the fire marshal was at the time of your program, who the instructor was, and then also who the chairperson of the Michigan Firefighter Training Council was at the time of your certificate. Again, if you have questions about the SMOKE program, please do not hesitate to reach out to your regional coordinator. Thank you and have a good day.